say that Shantou is a paradise full of delicacies. To understand Shantou, one should start with its most alluring nightlife. Eating spots just around the corner can represent the soul of delicacies from the coastal city. The feasts, overflowing with colour, aroma and flavour, seem to go on forever, from dinner through to late night snacks. Midnight darkness rearranges into dawn views, and the generous ocean's plates of seafood are delivered fresh to dining tables within minutes. Nanao Island sees the earliest morning light in Shantou, so one can enjoy the view of the sunrise while inhaling the fresh sea breeze. When the city wakes up every morning, people's taste buds also begin to stir. For guests hailing from all directions, Shantou greets them with hot, steaming breakfast. Located on the Tropic of Cancer, with more than 300 days of good air per year, Shantou has been granted the titles of Top City of Tourism in China and National Forest City. Seated between mountains, the city is surrounded by islands and harbours an inland bay. It forms an inland bay area, a unique geographic peculiarity in China. It enjoys a comfortable winter and a long summer. Life here moves slowly and happily, while its exquisite style has attracted holiday goers seeking coastal tours for years and years. Small Park is an old urban area in Shantou, housing China's largest arcade building complex built in the Republic of China period, maintaining the original appearance of the city. The arcade buildings and streets have witnessed centuries of history since Shantou began running businesses from the small park. Come and have a look at a department store from the last century. Sit on stage to watch some Chaozhou opera performances. The harmony and peace you feel in this old town will become part of your fond memory. Shantou has a coastline stretching 220 kilometers, extending from the east to the west. Three rivers converge here, whose abundant aquatic resources are turned into delicious marine products. Chaozhou cuisine follows an ancient cooking method developed during the period from the Qin through to the Song Dynasty. The exquisite dishes, among which there are many classic ones, are created with mild cooking methods. Every dish is cooked with meticulous care. Ingredients are made to produce the unique Chaoshan flavour by local chefs. And even the simplest of touches can be impressive, giving our taste buds an overwhelming delight. Want to visit the sea in Shantou? Nanao Island is the right place. When you think of Nanao, you think of summer. With mountains on one side and the sea on the other, a trip around Nanao Island will feel like a dream about being in a movie. Nanao Island is full of subtropical charm and is now a very bourgeois place to live, with resorts, hotels and B&Bs scattered across the mountains or by the sea, choose one to stay at and you can realise all of your ocean dreams through such activities as sea fishing, snorkelling and even beach parties. it is time for sports in the city. The International Marathon is coming, the Asian Youth Games are coming, and Shantou, the pearl of eastern Guangdong, is sending its youthful vitality to the world.
Chao Shan Kung Fu Tea is used in China's most classic traditional tea ceremony. It reflects an elegant attitude of Shantou people toward leisure. They make the time to make tea and do many other things. They pursue perfection from life to the arts, and Chao Shan's exquisite culture can be seen everywhere. The complex and classical culture left by the area's ancestors has always been respected, inherited, and loved. And locals still follow ancient customs for traditional festivals. Time passes by, and the traditions pass down from generation to generation. Shantou is much more 